You got some Mercs here. You know, I just recently found at a pawn shop in uh, Philly with some of those old uh, Liberty dollars. You remember those? Yeah. The guy got in big trouble for them. Yeah. I picked up a couple of them for spot price. They're like 50 cents over spot. Have y'all heard about that new thing out of Utah, the gold backs? Have you heard of that? So it's like um, printed currency that's actually uh, gold. So like you'll have like a gram of gold or a tenth of a gram of gold or whatever. So they're like using them as like currency in like Utah and like other places instead of like using the US dollar type thing. It's interesting, I've been looking at it. The problem with it is is when they do that onto the gold and it, if you try to remove it, you wind up losing it. It winds up going in the smoke. Is that what it is? Because the chemicals and stuff on the paper. So it's not recoverable. It's not recoverable. <laughs> Interesting. Well, I wouldn't jump all over it. Yeah. You know? It's brand new. It shouldn't have just started. Yeah. So I was looking at it. Oh, Frost of the Snowman coin. <laughs> <laughs> I might get that for, uh, I might get these for my nieces. <laughs> the quarter ounces have premium songs. Do they have much? Yeah, those are. Those are 10 bucks a piece. 10 bucks a piece, okay. Yeah. You can still have them, I just want you to know they're not. No, yeah, I think I'll For sure. I forgot to leave them in there. No worries. Man, that's funny. Looking through some 90. Got a lot of Mercs over here. That's my favorite design, Mercury Dawn. Nice, I think I'll take these quarters right here. There okay. you go. needs to be a Benjamin. 60, I don't have change. That's all right. I do. 364 change, please. Yeah, I was just thinking that. I'll take some 90% Kennedys. So I got a dollar face in the Mercs. So I got some uh, Canadian mint sets. And uh, if you guys are in town, you want to come in and find some Nice gentleman, and get yourself some gold and silver. And sometimes they have some crazy stuff in here you can't find anywhere. Valley. Okay. So we're at the second coin shop. Second coin shop. And it's I got silk coin. I just had a sip of this smart water, and I thought, hmm, maybe the smart thing is we should arm ourselves with some knowledge before we go in there. Good call. Because the last one we found, what were those Canadian? Yeah. Um. You guys, I need to do the math on this, but I'm pretty sure I got this at or under spot. Um, it has a Canadian um, dollar, half dollar, dime, and quarter. Um, so I'm going to have to do some math at this when I get back to the hotel and figure out exactly what I got. But see, I've got this little app here, and I'm just typing in 10 mercury dimes. It's just getting the melt price for a dollar face. It could be four quarters, whatever. So right now, $13.10 is melt. So if we can get anything at or below that uh, for like a dollar face, that's what we want to do. Mm -hmm. Do you think we can do it? This guy might be able to do it. I don't know. Uh, the last time I came in here, I made a video of this LCS. Um, I was actually really impressed with it. It's actually technically a pawn shop uh, to jewelry, AZ Jewelry uh, and Loan. However, the guy is really knowledgeable on coins and has a, a really, I mean, he straight up got all kinds of stuff. I was really impressed the last time I was in here. So I almost consider this being my next uh, LCS that's going to be mine. So let's check it out. It's going to be yours? You're going to buy it? I wish. No. <laughs> uh but it's, it's gonna be one that it's gonna, I'm gonna say this is probably my go-to. Uh, but let's go in there and check it out. Uh, do you, so you said it's a pawn shop? I think technically it's a pawn shop. So do you think uh, I can go in there and pawn this? Oh man, maybe. <laughs> All right, let's go, let's go get wonder, some silver. I wonder what you'd say about that. Are you gonna take it in? Nah. Oh, okay. 
I don't want to, I don't want to, uh, I don't even know what I'm going to say right now. The answer is no. Okay. I don't even know. I was trying, I was trying to think of something funny, but I couldn't do it. All right. Negative. We're not doing it. All right. Let's roll. For the best. I wonder what it would give me if I'm like, I want the whole box, what will you do? <laughs> I started grabbing some of them, but I haven't, uh, maybe I only have two rolls. 16 is really good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I got the Pikachu face when he told me. <laughs> Look at that, beautiful shape. So with Morgan's, what I like out a lot, um, when I'm picking is like the hair and the detail in the hair. Mm -hmm. Cause that's how you can tell, you know, easily how much silver is worn off of it by how detailed the hair is. Mm -hmm. So we're doing, we're doing this. We're going to do some, we're going to do some more than today. I mean, look what's going on back here. Oh, this man. should tell you something. I don't want to take this fast one. Dude, bro, there's plenty in here for both of us. No, I think, what if we buy the whole thing? <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what they would give us. What can I do? Maybe we should just buy it. <laughs> look, at, look at that one. That's kind of wild. Whoa. Maybe something Whoa. Like that half dollar was sitting on it or something. Or maybe they put acid on it or something. Uh -huh. Is that like a price tag or something on that one? Okay. Okay. Maybe they got some really nice beef dollars in here too. Yeah, that's probably what they're doing. If I wasn't traveling so much, I probably would be like coming through the whole box. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's the type of stuff I'll, I'll, I'll pop in. Yeah, I think they're all going to be 21s in here. Still epic. Usually clothes are 16. You know what I mean? Especially with really the spot, man. especially with the spot price going up. So what I'm doing is I'm just picking the best ones, mm -hmm. and I'm not going to get them all. So I'm going to pick the best ones out of there, so I'll let you take a look at what I'm not going to get, because maybe they're better than some of the ones, you know what I mean? Yeah. Some good shape ones. Also, too, I like Morgans if they have, like, an epic tone to them, you know? Yeah, oh, yeah. Quick ping test on them. <laughs> these are easy to ping test. Yeah, I've, uh, I used to buy off of like Opera and like, different apps, and I've uh, definitely got taken advantage of once or twice on that. Did you? Fortunately, yeah, they were, uh, Fix. they were made with something else, steel, something. They even sounded good. Yeah. The weight gave it away. I have one that's actually the right weight, but it's. See, the, t the key a lot of people don't get is that it's not really the, the, frequency, the, not really the frequency of the ring, although it kind of is, 
It's hot if it resonates. Because you can have fakes that kind of sound close and pitch. Yeah. But see how that resonates for so long? Yeah. That's the key. That's how you know they're real. So all those are pinging. All those are pinging great. I'm going to just flip up the bunch from the bottom. Okay. How much do you, uh, for like pre-1900 Morgans, do you charge? 18. 18? I mean, 18 is still a good deal for pre-1900, but it's not as good of a deal as these are for 16. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Him if he's got other things. So. All right. And I have a gold and silver YouTube channel, oh. and I do videos buying gold and silver all over the world, Middle East, Europe. You have a card? I don't, but if you just search International Stacker on okay. Google or YouTube, you'll find me. <laughs> but it's fun. It is fun. We bought some in Egypt not long ago for the pyramids. Yeah. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. So the two of you work together? Well, he has his own channel. He's based out of Arizona. Yep. So while I'm in town, I met up with him. Oh, well, nice. First time meet up, collaborating a little bit. Yeah, a little collaboration. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Ready to get out of here? Let's roll. Let's well, it's that time I have to say bye. Thank you so much, Billy AZ Prospector. Later, IS. Did you have fun, man? Oh, it was a blast. Did you? I had a ton of fun, man. Awesome. Great food, great times. We got a lot of great deals. Oh, yeah. I'm looking forward to the next time. You know what I think? Up. I think the next time I'm in town, we need to live up a little bit more to your name. We All need right. to go find us some real treasure. Hey, I, I know some places we could go. Maybe that's a bad idea, guys. She's going to throw me down a mine shaft and take my stack. Uh oh. All right, bro. Keep See ya. Hey, take it easy, man. Pleasure. Catch you on the next one? Yeah, catch you on the next one. Woo!